Children learn more by imitation than information. How many of you took time to begin to tell your child for you to walk, move your leg like this, move this one like that? The child didn't learn by information. The child learned by imitation. They saw you walking and they began walking. So if that child see you slapping each other, what do you think he will start doing? Slapping. Now say, why are you fighting in school? He said, that's what I saw at home. Daddy slapped mommy. Mommy slapped daddy. So when I go, I see she slap she she slap me. They will hear what you say, but they will do what you do. This is so important. They learn more by imitation than they will by information. So if you don't lay a quality example, you will nullify the instructions that you are giving to them. That's why it becomes important for you and I to ensure that on a daily basis, we are laying the necessary example for our children to follow after. May grace come upon each one of us for this. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I said may grace come upon each one of us for this. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I said may grace come upon each one of us for this. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. That is the beauty of an example. Some years ago, when my daughter was, you know, quite young, she looked at her mother one day and said to her, Mommy, I'm going to marry Daddy. Mommy said, No. Why are you saying so? He said, I like the way Daddy treats you. And I want to have that kind of experience. And then she said, Daddy is already married to mommy. God will give you your own like daddy. Imagine if the story was different. The child will say, me, I don't want to go near any man. I see how daddy has been mistreating mommy. That child at that time, I'm not sure she was up to five. But she was seeing what no one was saying. Please hear this and hear it very well. There is more that is communicated by action than you communicate by speaking. Lay a solid example. Lay a solid example. The child that never saw you pray, what do you think will make that child pray? The one who never saw you going to church, what do you think will make the child go to church? The one who never saw you read Bible except when you are looking for it and ransacking the house because it's Sunday morning again. What makes you think that that child will make the scriptures a priority? Lay an example. Lay an example. My prayer for each one of us is that grace will come upon us to lay solid examples for our children in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. What we are saying is simply this. It will take a spiritually robust parent to sow spiritual seeds that will bring supernatural fruits.